Hello everyone, Tail here. I'm playing Rise of Flight. Now, obviously, Reginald Penguin is no more, which means we have to find a new pilot to inhabit. So, let's do that. I'm going to be a German this time, and I'm going to be a German scout pilot. I've already thought of a name. Klaus Barracuda. This time I'm not taking any shit. I'm going to be from Bavaria. Because why not? Uh, start date, I think I've already worked out, will be... Here we go, 1st of the 1st, 1917. And I'm going to be joining... Let's have a look. I don't know too much about the different Yasters, so I'm not sure which one I should pick. And which one's the most famous one. Uh, let's make sure this one's actually on the France map rather than the Channel. Novice. Whoops. Elite, novice, elite. Yes, the four. Uh, maybe, or five. Yes, the six. Status veteran, that sounds good. I'll just D2, that sounds good. Veal self, I'm not sure what that is, but uh, we'll go with it. And uh, I'm going to be an Oberleutnant. There we go. Great campaign. So, who do we have? We have Commander Ludwig Sauerbeck, me, Oberleutnant Jörg Bahr, Leutnant Nils Wiedemann, Leutnant Heiner Reismann, Leutnant Sigwald Stockhausen, Leutnant Hans Kirchstein, uh, whatever this means, Tobias Mittermeier, Erich Wimpfen, and Emmich Schonbaum. There we go. And I'm the second in command, apparently, even though I have no missions and no victories. Let's take a look at the map. Where are we? We're here, right on the bend of the front. Excellent. Uh, intelligence, let's have a look. These are the opposing squadrons. Mostly French, it seems. Friendly squadrons. Friendly key personnel nearby. Enemy key personnel. There's that guy namer. All right then, so here we are. Uh, and I'm flying the Albatross D2. Let me just make sure I'm all configged up. Oh, this needs to change. We'll go with medium. I think. I can't quite remember what the best settings are. Let's try medium with all of them and see how we do. Advanced config. Uh, max pilot injury. Or death, of course. Just for ace term, we'll put that at a five. Uh, do, do, do mission AI, ground objects. Ten times flak, switch that off. Uh, and everything else we can leave as it is, I think. Accept. All right, let's get a mission. What are we doing? We're patrol patrolling, of course. That's our main job. So we're going to have a patrol along the front here uh, at just over 3,000 meters, which is quite high. Uh, taking off at 9 a.m. Patrol airspace is me, Reisman and Mittermeier on this flight. Okay, I will accept your mission. Thank you. Good. Let's get on with it. Let's head to the game and see how we do. All right, here we are. This is where I live. This airfield here, I think. Right next to Ham. Mmm. Ham. Uh, San Quentin is nearby. Over the front. Do we have anything important around? Doesn't look like it. Although I'm sure some people recognize some features of this map. Let's take a look at my ride. Here she is. Uh, let's see. Yes to six. I want yes to six. Do we have one for yes to six? No. Oh, oh well. I guess I'll have to pick something. Maybe yes to five. Because it's kind of close. Uh, I think somebody said I can set skins in uh, the campaign generator. I'll have to check that out. Uh, let's see. What do I want? I would like to have a gun sight, please. Actually, no. I don't think... With these German planes, you can just aim... Down the middle, it's not really necessary to have a gun sight, and the sight is off-center anyway. There we go. 
Um, I don't want a Becca. And we'll leave this. I'm, I'm not uh, taking a streamer because it um, sometimes casts wibbly shadows across my plane. I don't like it. Maybe if somebody, people complain about the streamer, then I'll change my mind. Anyway, let's start. Oh, here we go. All right, here I am. A, I am A class, straight A's, A plus, etc. Okay, hopefully, oh, I do have a streamer. That's weird. Oh well. Um, hopefully, I do quite well in this plane, and I uh, I'm actually able to shoot things down. I think I'm usually better in the German planes than I am in the Allied planes. <clears throat> Excuse me, although I normally play Allied Online because most people play Germany and I don't like joining the outnumbered side which is probably stupid of me but there we go you guys taken off? Yes they are, good oh, there we go, it is January so it's cold frosty it's, it's sehr kalt as uh, Jesus, I've forgotten his name already. Barracuda. It's, uh, is it Carl? Or oh, I may have picked some different name. Never mind. I'm sure I'll remember. It only came up with it about five minutes ago, so that's why I've forgotten it so so soon. Uh, let's take a look at it in flight. Make sure. I Try and stay on a level heading. Okay. Well, it's skippage time. Uh, because obviously it's going to take me a while to fly out to do the patrol as usual. I've lost my teammates already. Hold on. There they are. Come on, guys. Hello Tobias, Heiner, okay yes I'll skip here as I fly on my first ever sortie in an albatross in career mode and I'll rejoin you shortly. Okay quick update First of all, the streamer is wibbling. The streamer is wibbling across my plane. Stop wibbling. Second of all, I am up at almost 3,000 meters uh, on the wrong side of the lines, as and I mean the enemy side, flying around looking for dudes to shoot. And so far, nothing. I feel I might need to up the air density to high actually get any action uh, unless something spawns in pretty soon this might have been a wasted patrol I'm coming to the end of the waypoint here I think that's the river down there uh, which is this thing yep yeah. so I guess all I can do is turn around and fly back and hope something appears but so far I'm afraid it's been a little bit uh, Boring, but the plane flies nice. It seems to climb fairly well, nice and stable, so that's okay. Uh, I'll come back if anything entertaining happens. I'm afraid the Tommies have not come out to play. All we've seen is a balloon, but that's been winched down, so you can't really attack that. Uh, so I suppose I'm afraid it's uh, time to head home. This has been a massive waste of time, and also my engine does not have a temperature. At least it very barely has one. Hopefully it doesn't stop working. Um, yeah, so I'm heading north now, back to my airfield. I'm going to turn the air density up to high for the next mission, so hopefully there will be planes in the next video. But for this one, 
all you get is me taking off, wibbling around, and then uh, landing. So, apologies for that. Um, at least I get to land my plane. And I guess at least I get one mission under my belt. So, uh, I'll come back when it's landing time. Ah, uh, you know what? I think we might have some action after all. There are planes here, but I've just told my men to return to base. Ah, uh, uh, do like me. Don't return to base. We've got things out here. I've got the icons turned on so I can see them. Who are these dudes? Not too sure. I don't know where my friends have gone either. Where are they? That might be them down there. In which case, I'm on my own. Whoa, there's a lot of planes. They're all in our airspace. Uh, I'm not too sure what to do because I'm all, all alone. Come back! Oh, God damn it! Never tell your wingmen to return to base before you actually get back to base. I'm going to have to try and uh, maintain my aerial advantage with these planes, assuming they are enemies. Let's turn off the icons, just to make it a bit more realistic, I suppose. I'm not too sure what they are. Get rid of the map. Uh, let's dive down and get a closer look here. There's something moving down there, but I can't tell what it is. I'm too high. These planes are all like a thousand meters or more below me. I think those are my friends maybe flying around the airbase, although if they are they managed to descend pretty quickly. Three planes down there. They're heading to our base, so they could be friendly. Things following me. Oh no, anti aircraft fire. We didn't even need to leave the base. Make sure I'm not over revving the engine. Speed is very high. Well, hopefully my friends have spotted these guys and are going to take some action. I think that's an albatross right there. Where'd these three planes go? an albatross I think. Ah, just look at the anti-aircraft fire, there we go. What are these guys, Newports? If so, what are they doing flying? Or maybe they're attacking my, my uh, wingmen, that could be the reason. Here we go then. Make sure my guns are cocked. Death from above, baby. Oh, they're chasing all my uh, comrades. Or comrades, or whatever you call it. Whoa, what's this? Oh no, they've got, oh, they've got rear gunners. I think they do. What are these things? RE8s? Maybe. I guess they're French RE8s. Okay, well this makes things a bit more tricky. Or they could be strutters, actually. I 
think these are socket shutters. That is uh, kind of ironic, given the fate of Reginald Penguin. If I get shot down by a shutter, then I deserve it. Oh, and there's an FE-2B, I think. It could be an FE-2C. I think they only have the, the B version in the game, actually. This should be easy meat. A little bit of a hit in there. Good thing about these is the gunner is in the front. Oh. God damn it. Don't crash. Hi there. Is this a strutter attacking me? I think so. No, no, that's another FE2B. The bad thing is that they've got a gunner in the front. Well, this is actually turning into quite an exciting... Uh, engagement. If you come up from below and behind, then that should be a sitting duck. Although, that's not the way to do it. Let's try this guy. Come on, come on. Get the engine. I don't know where the uh, strutters have gone. Maybe they're still attacking my friends. But these are the real targets. Two-seaters, observation aircraft, have I said before. That's what we're here to destroy. I think I might have hit his engine there. As long as I stay behind them, I should be pretty safe. They all seem to be leaking stuff. Or at least the... Uh, oh! Standing up, I didn't count on that. The gunner can stand up. Uh, come on, come on, pull up. Try not to crash into him. Oh, no, that's not going to work. Come on. Um, right a bit, right a bit. Fuck you! Die! How is he still going? Come on, come on. Oh shit! Tunnel vision. Did not look behind me. What was that? Was that the other FE2? Maybe. Or a shutter? So now I've been hit. Can't imagine how that plane is still moving. The amount of bullets I pumped into it. Oh, hello. hello. I didn't know you were there. that. Something was shooting at me there. It might have been that plane, but the bullets looked like they weren't coming from him. Okay, here we go. Just need to be careful not to die. That's very important for a fighter pilot. If I get hit again, I'll probably have to call it a day. It's Certainly if my engine gets hit. Uh, but yeah, these FE2s are pretty much obsolete 
by this time of the war, uh, as far as I know. Whoa. But uh, the Royal Flying Corps didn't have any replacements, so basically they just had to keep sending men out in these outdated planes. Uh, eventually the RE-8 came along to replace the FB-2. That took a while to come about. And even the RE-8 um, pilots were kind of scared of it. But they tended to always be a bit scared of new planes that came in. They always got nicknames like the Flying Death Bath or, you know, what have you. But generally they're actually pretty good planes. The RE-8 was, anyway, you know. In a good pilot. See, this guy is pretty much a sitting duck while I'm behind him, which is not ideal because planes always attack from behind. Certainly when they're as slow as these uh, planes. Oh, I've only got one gun firing. Come on. Pull up all you like, my friend. It won't save you. Is he going down? He's going down! My first kill. I'm sorry, guys. It's not my fault you were given an outdated death plane to fly around in. And he's crashed. Alright, now I just need to work out where the hell I am. That might be my airfield over there, or it could be someone else's airfield. I don't think my airfield had a big tower in it. Uh, where was I again? Bill Selv. I think that could be it down there. In which case it does have a big tower. There's a road. I think that's... Bill Self, is it? Uh, I don't know. Kind of lost. Let me try and get my bearings. There's a river. Uh, I think that's Epperville there. Which means this could be Golang Core I'm flying over right now. That would make sense, and therefore yourself should be this away. Let's fly east. Where the hell is it? Is that Vilself there? I think it's just like a village. Advanced navigation with tail. Um, it's next to quite a big lump of forest, so it could be over here. Maybe I should just land anywhere. It doesn't really matter, does it? The blood in my eyes is not helping. Okay, so that is Golan Core, so Bill Self should be under me, I think. Or nearby, but it doesn't appear to be. There's where those two roads cross there, so it should be south, I think. It should be over here. Well, I guess I'll skip here while I flail around trying to find my airfield. And I'll be back shortly. Oh, is that it? Screw it, this is it. 
it's near a little forest. That looks like it might be Bill Self there, and there's a big little forest there. So yeah, I'm going to say this is my airfield. I don't care if it is or it isn't. I'm injured, goddammit. I need urgent care. Now oh, then, let's see how I do on the landing. The plane isn't too uh, battered or bruised, so it should be fairly straightforward. Roll rate it seems pretty good. A bit of turbulence. Going a bit too fast here, but never mind. Let's just land near the airfield. I can always walk back. Or get carried on the stretcher back. Okay, pulling up a little bit. And we're kind of down, but we're going pretty fast. Slow down. Good. I've landed. Engine off. Nice. Let's, uh, there we go, that's good. Got a clear view now. Here I am. I've got my first kill. Let's take a look so we can see the enemy. Here is the strutter. It's got bombs. And it's with his fellow strutters. Here's an RE8, I think. Yeah, it looks like an RE8 to me. Quite a few of them. And that's it. All the FE2s have crashed or have uh, um, despawned. Good. That was a pretty good first mission in the end. We had to come back from our patrol in order to actually find any planes. Um, I've now been wounded, which means I'm probably going to be out of action for a month or two. Let's head back to the campaign generator and see how that all panned out. Alright, first mission of Klaus Barracuda. Let's see how he did. Combat report. Victors claimed one. Type of victory. Ah, FE2B. What was I calling it? I think, did I call it FE2B? I might call it something else by accident. I apologise. Anyway, FE2B. Submit report. Start debrief. So he flew out here. Flew along here. Nothing happened. So he flew back again. And then lots of stuff happened. A strutter was destroyed. I damaged an FE2B. Tobias Mittermeier was destroyed. Uh, again, I damaged an F2B. I was damaged. I damaged an F2B. Another strutter was destroyed. Damaged. Herner Reisman was destroyed. I guess this is the uh, strutter fight. And then finally, I destroyed an FE2B. Yes! Debrief completed. Uh, remarks on flight and hostile aircraft. Successes include the following strutter shot down by Reisman. FE2B shot down by Barracuda. Strutter shot down by Mittermeier. And I was injured, and the two pilots escaped with their lives. Uh, and I will be unavailable for some weeks. And I've got my first medal. Oh, I've got to change my face as well. This is what I look like. Klaus Barracuda, look at him. He's a badass. Finish reading. There we go. My first mission under the belt. One victory. And now we switch to the Albatross D2 late. And it's the 6th of February, so we've missed a month. Okay, so uh, that turned out to be a pretty good mission in the end. Uh, let me just, let's see here, advanced config, no that's not what I want. Air density high, let's set that at that. There we go, accept, and see how we do from there. Great, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time for the second mission of the career of Klaus Barracuda. Thanks for watching again and I'll see you next time, goodbye.